Hello and welcome to the Leica Geosystems Tech Insider, where we cover the news and trends that matter to you in your business. Today, we're talking to mobile mapping consultant, Jason Ellis, about the launch of the new Pegasus TRK100 mobile mapping system from Leica Geosystems, part of Hexagon. Welcome, Jason. Hello. So Jason, first let's talk about the Pegasus TRK technology. The TRK100 is the newest system, but Leica Geosystems launched the TRK500 and TRK700 in May of 2022 which ushered in a completely new approach to mobile mapping. In fact, some industry leaders have said it's a quantum leap in mobile mapping. What is so significant about the TRK solution? The thing about the TRK is not, it's not the LIDAR, it's not the imagery. Everybody offers that, everybody's got that. They've all had it, we've all done it for years. What is special about the TRK? Honestly, what's special about it is the experience. And that's pervasive through all of the units, the 100, the 500, the 700. The experience is the same. And the experience is, wow, this is freaking easy. And uh, the results are amazing. The LIDAR is still, li I mean, LIDAR is LIDAR. Data is data. We haven't made any advancements in that realm for years. Um, Nobody has. And I don't know that there's any meaningful advancements to make. I'll probably eat those words someday, but LIDAR and imagery is just data. It's the experience, like, you know, the implementation of it, the using it in the field, in the office, that kind of soup to nuts experience, that streamlined and easy, where I only have to go into a company's office for three or four hours. I can show them everything and leave. And they're like, this is incredible. So because it's so easy to use in the field and in the office, um, with just a little bit of training, you know, anybody can be effective with the TRK. So um, it's exciting in that regard because the barriers of entry have just really been uh, removed. Um, you know, it's been hard for people to find experts to run these systems and manage data in the office. Um, so with lowering the threshold without compromising quality, um, it's really easy for for companies to get into mobile now. That's what makes the TRK special. In the launch announcement for the TRK100, I saw an interesting note about a new capability in point cloud refinement called MatchPoint. Can you tell us about this innovation? Yeah, uh, MatchPoint is an AI-driven algorithm that uh, it looks at the LIDAR, and basically what it's doing is uh, it's taking the native precision of the LIDAR and it's improving it. So what that means is we're able to get better results out of the sensor than the sensor is capable of collecting natively by you know on its own. Uh, so that's really exciting and really just uh, a great example of the innovative work that we're doing at Leica. Pricing is an issue too, right? And I know we can't share specific figures because there's a lot involved in configuring a system to meet the needs of each user. But someone who has seen the cost of the TRK system as a barrier to moving forward with the technology is going to be keenly interested in the new TRK100. For sure, yeah. Uh, cost to entry has been a bit of a challenge. Um, but the TRK100 definitely addresses this. So uh, it's much lower cost of entry and uh, it's highly effective. So what I mean by that is, you know, just because it's a lower cost system doesn't mean that you're compromising anything in terms of the navigation solution or the ease of use. Um, none of that changes. You're getting the full TRK experience. You're getting the TRK trajectory quality. There's no compromise there, um, but it allows companies to get into mobile mapping and pursue what they have in mind in terms of, you know, maybe it's geospatial contracts, um, maybe uh, utility mapping, infrastructure uh, management mapping, uh, urban planning. You know, if these are the types of things that they have in mind for a mobile operation, then yeah, the TRK100 is a perfect fit. Um, but if they're looking more along the lines of doing that 
that high precision survey or design grade type work, the 500 or the 700 is the, is what they're going to want to be looking at. So ultimately, it sounds like there's now a solution for anyone who is interested in high speed data collection with mobile mapping without the complexity and data management bottlenecks of the past. For sure. Yeah. The 100, 500 and 700 really offers everything that you would need in any type of mobile scenario. So there's different types of LIDAR sensors for the specific type of work that you've got in mind. Um, but to me, again, what's great about it is that everybody benefits from these streamlined, simple workflows without compromising quality in any way. Of course, the best way to understand the potential impact of this technology in your business is to explore it for yourself. Our Reality Capture team will be at several upcoming events with the TRK, won't they, Jason? For sure. We'll be at Topodot Users Conference. We'll be at the uh, FIG FIG Working Week. Um, we'll be at Hexagon Live, the Esri Users Conference, and a lot of regional events as well. Hey, fantastic opportunities. Of course, you can also reach out to our team anytime for guidance in your reality capture journey or any challenge you face in surveying and mapping. We look forward to hearing from you. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for access to future interviews and insights. Thanks for watching.